This is Glenn, and we hope you enjoy this list of 15 unusual aircraft from yesterday to today. Thank you for watching Mind's Eye Design. Number 15. The Aerole is powered by electricity that comes from three different power sources, including solar panels that cover the wings providing part of the power, while hydrogen offers some, and a combustion engine running on total biojet fuel, instead of the initially planned marine algae, provides the rest. Pilot Rafael Dinelli and his team hope to get the plane up to 70 hours of flight time, after which they'll have a test flight from New York to La Bourget, France this summer following Charles Lindbergh's historic flight across the Atlantic. Number 14. Designed by Barnaby Wayne Fan, a Northrop Grumman aerodynamicist, the Wayne Fan FMX4 Facet Mobile is a low aspect ratio, experimental home-built sport airplane. The first flight happened in April of 93, and the plane has approximately 130 hours of total flight time. Number 13. A single-engine jet aircraft by Metal Master, the Flaris LAR-1, completed its first flight on April 8th of this year. Test flights confirmed that the lightweight five-seat personal jet could take off using less than 330 feet of runway. An incredibly low takeoff weight, advanced propulsion, and exceptional aerodynamics give this reduced emissions and low consumption rate. The Lars 1 can also climb at a rate of 5,900 feet per minute. Metal Master hopes to have certification from Poland by the end of the year and the European Union Aviation Safety Agency by the end of 2020. Number 12. The Proteus, built in 1997 and 98, is designed by Bert Rutan the Proteus features a tandem wing, twin boom configuration with two rear-mounted turbofan engines supplying power. It can carry loads at altitudes above 50,000 feet and remain on a mission for up to 14 hours. Number 11. Developed in the early 80s as a replacement for the King Air, the Beechcraft Starship is a twin turboprop powered six to eight passenger aircraft with pusher propellers and a front canard wing. A costly aircraft, this used a fully composite airframe and a glass cockpit. Designed by Burt Rutan, the Starship had the added safety feature of being practically stall proof. If the aircraft tries to stall, the canards stall first, which makes the nose drop slightly and ensures the main wing continues to fly, allowing for stall recovery. Number 10. French creator Lisa invented the light aircraft Akoya, a blend of impressive performance, smooth lines, and unique versatility. The two-seat aircraft is unique because it can land on land, water, or snow. The most important innovation is the patented seafoil technology that allows the plane to take off from water. Small, fin-like wings under the aircraft let it operate in the water while performing well in the air. The aircraft's retractable landing gear is fitted with both skis and wheels, making it the only aircraft that can take off from snow and land on water. Number 9. Founded in 2012, Dinelli Aerosystems was created with the intention of manufacturing and developing a multifunctional gyrocopter. The Exo Gyro comes in 16 different models. These aircraft come with four doors, have up to five seats, a coax pusher propeller system, and V-tail, a coax rotor system, and have full integration of disaster management systems. Number eight. Developed by Carter Aviation Technologies, the Carter Copter is a hybrid between an airplane and a rotor craft. Slowed rotor or compound technology combines the vertical takeoff and landing of a helicopter with the range, efficiency, and speed of an airplane. Slowing the rotor to about one-third of the normal RPM reduces rotor drag 
and translates into better fuel efficiency, a continuous hover capability, and quiet operation. Carter is now trying to get this jump takeoff aircraft to market and is focused on production planning, licensing the technology, or forming a joint venture. Number seven. The Rutan Voyager is a twin-engine, twin-boom, single-wing, home-built aircraft that was made for long-distance flight and includes 17 fuel tanks. This is unique in the fact that it is constructed almost entirely of lightweight graphite honeycomb composite materials. Both engines are used for takeoff and climbing, and then the front engine turns off to save fuel during flight. The Voyager was the first aircraft to fly non-stop around the world without refueling. Number six. Larger than most general aviation aircraft, the Velocity XL, the flagship of the Velocity line, has the largest cabin of all four-seat kit aircraft. 10 inches longer and five and a half inches wider, the XL is 47 and a half inches shoulder to shoulder. One inch increased seat height for the pilot and co-pilot and two inches increased on the rear seats. The XL has a cruise speed of 200 knots and the recommended engine capacity for this single-engine airplane is 260 to 310 horsepower. Number five. Marketed by BJ Schramm in 1958 as a single-seat amateur-built helicopter, the Schramm Javelin is made of an aluminum body shell, a tubular steel structure, and powered by a Mercury powerboat engine. Designed to be easy to fly, this had few components for quick and easy maintenance. The helicopter first flew in 1965, then it was redesigned as the Scorpion, and they claimed to make 250 of them using SRAM's new company, Rotorway Aircraft Incorporated. SRAM built the prototype Scorpion in 1966, and production of the kits started in 1968. Number four. The Aventura Aero, made for extended range and endurance, has a cost-effective multi-mission capability. This is safe, comfortable, and fun to fly. Easy to operate and to learn, these feature a highly efficient four-blade carbon fiber propeller and detachable fuel tanks. You can ride in comfort with a seat heating system and side-by-side -side cockpit. Number three. Aeroflight X, based near Munich, Germany, unveiled its V600 prototype on April 10th at the Aero Friedrichshafen 2019 Aviation Trade Show. The all-electric aircraft has two sets of wings, six propellers for lift, a pusher propeller for forward flight, and a tricycle landing gear. The completed vehicle can carry three to five people and can make changes to meet EASA certification requirements. Number two. Built near Kindle Airfield near Eisenach, Germany, the Horton HX2 premiered at the Aero 2019 in April. This cost-effective two-seater is a light aircraft with no hull. The HX2 flies faster and farther than comparable fuselage-based airplanes because of its low drag and is suited for future integration of any new drive technology. Horton plans call for autonomous and multi-seated versions of the present prototype. Number one. Vision Jet is a jet that is meant to be flown by the owner and does not require a professional pilot. A revolution in flying, this fills the void between a lightweight jet and high-performance pistons. Wasting little time, Cirrus improved on the Collier Trophy winning Vision Jet and unveiled the Generation 2 SF-50 with a new flight deck, a maximum altitude increase, Garmin Perspective Touch, improved high altitude performance, and plenty of cabin enhancements. And the Vision Jet sets new standards in safety with the Cirrus Airframe Parachute System. If you need more info on any of the aircraft featured today, you can find the websites and prices, if there is one to see, in the description. We hope you enjoyed this video of 15 unusual aircraft, and thanks for watching. Hi, everyone.
everyone and thank you for watching. I'm Chandni with Mind's Eye Design. We love to hear your feedback, so please leave some comments below and let us know your favourite from this video and why you liked it. If you have an idea for a future video, leave another comment and let us know. And then if we use your idea, we'll give you a shout out in that video. But don't leave yet. Keep watching because there's more.